Hey everyone, it's Jason with Onward Up. One question that we often get is, what's the difference between the spirit, carabiner and quick draw, and the gym? So I'm just going to take a few minutes to talk about the differences between the two. Let's start with the carabiner. If you watched uh, the Universal Features video um, that I posted earlier, uh, all of those apply to both of these carabiners. So H-beam construction, key lock, really long-lasting durable spring, wide rope bearing surface for longevity. One difference is the size. So the gin is a bit of a bigger size carabiner, so bigger gate opening. Somebody who is, um, you know, maybe just starting to climb might find this one just a little bit easier to, to handle. But at the same time, um, it is a little bit heavier. So uh, for the carabiners, um, the gin is six grams heavier than the spirit. Okay, so there's a little bit of a weight difference there. And then um, there's also a, a cost difference. So uh, the gin carabiner is uh, $3 less than the Spirit. So it's a little bit more economical. So you save a little bit of money, but you sacrifice a little bit of weight. When we look at the bent gate side, there's a difference with those carabiners as well. Obviously the size, the weight difference, the cost difference. But there's one uh, subtle difference on the gate and on the spirit, there is a really flat piece that's kind of carved out so that you have a really positive place to, to push against uh, for clipping. So really, really, really easy to clip. Whereas the gin is more of just a classic round bar stock. Okay, so it, you know, doesn't have quite the ease of clipping. However, it is a little bit of a bigger size. So um, the gate clearance, which is this distance here, is bigger. So again, maybe if you're just new, newer to climbing, um, you know, you've got lots of room to, to put a rope in there. The other difference when you look at the quick draws is the dog bone that connects the two carabiners. So the gin is more of a classic dog bone. It's totally straight, okay? Um, you know, it's a thick material, so it's gonna be quite durable and won't have a lot of twisting. It has the string on the outside to hold that rope side carabiner in place and also to protect the sling. Whereas the spirit is just more of an ergonomic shape to the dog bone. You can see how it's tapered. So that makes it easier to grab onto you know, when you're really pumped and, uh, you know, you're just trying to get the rope clipped so you don't fall off. Likewise, it has uh, the string um, as well. When you're looking at the quick draws, um, as far as price goes, um, if we're looking at the 17 centimeter version, so the longer version, which would be this length here, this one's the 11, um, the Spirit is around 7 to $8 more, depending on which length you're looking at. Okay, so if you're looking at a whole rack of them, let's say 10 or 12, you know, that does add up. Okay, so um, if you're on a little bit more of a budget, you can still get all these really awesome features. Um, you know, sacrifice a little bit of weight, but you can save yourself, you know, a fair bit of money spread across a whole rack. The other nice thing is with the uh, gin, you can buy a six pack, okay, which is only available with the gin 12 centimeter. So the shorter version than this one. And, um, you know, by buying a six pack, as opposed to six of them individually, you'll save yourself uh, $23. Okay, so again, let's say you're buying 12, that's gonna save you $46. So there is a bit of a cost advantage there. So to summarize, you know, if money was no object, um, the spirit, would probably be the way to go to get something that's a little bit lighter. It's gonna be a little bit easier to clip, a little bit more ergonomic sling. If you're on a bit of a budget, the gin 
would be a great choice. You could buy them individually or the six pack to save you even more money. And you're gonna have you know, a really functional, easy clipping and handling quick draw or carabiner um, that's gonna last you a really long time. Thanks for listening.